it is at that point of the faction season where it's crunch time. As you guys know, over here on Complex, if we check out the F top page, there's two different numbers. The left side is your fully aged value and the right side is your potential value. So that's how many spawners you have placed. And every single spawner actually takes three weeks to go ahead and fully age. And well, we've got a lot of spawners to place and we only have like eight days left in the season. Not good looks. But if we check it out, we're currently sitting at number six. We do have enough value for number five. We just need more value to go ahead and age. And in today's episode, we're placing in literally everything we have in inside of this three by three base now if we check it out i have tons of spawners in my pv i have a bunch in a vault we have billions of dollars in our faction bank and not to mention we could sell our collection chest for hundreds of millions even billions as well we are at the point of the season where you either pray you don't get raided and you place on f-top or well the only alternative is literally getting raided so what i actually want to go ahead and do is show you guys really quickly our value boxes that we currently have set up like they're gonna be super hard to breach for anybody raiding at this point because we kind of have like a toxic design i'm not gonna lie i came up with this so we have three different main value boxes spread out so one chunk here one chunk here and then one chunk over here and there's tons of value in each box and we're probably gonna like double the value of every single box but look at how the people rating us have to breach they have to breach at this magma cream block or higher so essentially speaking they have to breach at y301 or all the way to Y313. So you have like 12 blocks to breach us. And look at the regions on this base. It is gonna take forever. There's gonna be so many Kaba monsters. There's gonna be so many clips as well that I am just praying and hoping to God nobody can breach our main value. So what I wanna go ahead and actually do right now is go ahead and grab so much value from my vault. I'll actually go ahead and show you guys how much we do have. Because in my PV, like I mentioned, I do have a ton of iron golems and creepers left from the raid in the last episode. I have got like a row of evokers and a row and a half of IGs and like some crappy spawners here i don't think we have any zombies or skellies left in here either oh and i legit have like so many dubs of chicken spawners i have no idea where to put them all right let's see it's three dubs six nine twelve fifteen and sixteen seventeen like eighteen eighteen and a half dubs of chickens i we we just don't have enough space i'm not gonna lie so let me actually go ahead and grab the remaining of our value there we go and then also in my pv3 let's grab all the iron golems that i can and i've got a full inventory okay well let's go ahead and get to placing them i'm probably gonna try to evenly space them out just in case one of our value boxes do get breached then hopefully they can't hit the other ones and i'm actually not even sure i feel like i'm gonna have to go ahead and mine all these chicken spawners because we have two chicken grinders bro i have no idea why we have two chicken grinders right here making us actually a decent amount of money so i'll probably go ahead and mine all of those and fill those up with like evokers and iron golems as well but i'm gonna go ahead and get to placing let's go ahead and take actually a screenshot and see we're at 634 right now i think we'll be at at least a billion oh my god bro i even completely forgot so in our faction, we have something called the F Warp Hub, and it's in spawn, so it's unraidable. But basically, the entire faction is like putting their spawners in chests throughout the entire season, and we legit have so many spawners to place as well. Oh my, we legit have so many to place. Oh my, all right, we have got more value than I expected. I cannot lie. I uh, I'm for sure gonna have to mine those chicken boxes. All right, yeah, I hate to say it, but the chickens gotta go. Oh my god, we actually just shot up to almost a billion already. We've got 47,000 chickens placed. Every single time, I want to go ahead and mine one one stack which is 50 it costs 56k well there's a little bit of a glitch and i don't know if it's bannable or not but i'm gonna use it but if you just f on claim and then f claim again the exact same chunk you can pick them all up completely for free cost of mine free place recently all right thank you very much i'll take my chicken spawners back and they are going straight into the vault with the other 18 dubs okay who would have imagined mining 50,000 chicken spawners would have taken that long because it actually did and then i went ahead and set up a couple more value boxes because the rule on complex is you're allowed six value boxes so we have a one right here with a ton of value you this box over here we've got our third box our fourth box our fifth box and then finally our sixth box which has like all of our xp spawners zombies and skeletons which is also completely maxed out so now we have a full six boxes and uh still a plenty of room to go ahead and fill up this one so what i actually want to go ahead and do as you guys saw earlier if i go to f warp collect we have legit like five billion probably to go ahead and sell if we also add in the rating outpost buff you get an extra 20 percent shot bonus which is gonna be massive and then i also have candy corn to get like 190 percent booster so we'll be selling for literally over double we go ahead and check it out one chest like 100 million 332 million there 76 million 400 million 115 47 million another 182 yeah we legit just have so much money sitting in here and then also in our f bank we have over two billion dollars which is gonna go straight into evoker spawners so let me actually go ahead and take off my god set because i'm assuming i'm hoping relentless surely is not checking walls right surely they're not checking outpost walls let me go ahead and actually 
TP on in there. I'm gonna claim and then probably just set up a blueprint because I cannot be bothered to actually go ahead and bail like an actual cannon. I don't know. Hopefully they're not around. Hopefully they're not checking walls. I'm gonna go ahead and set up a cannon. I'll bring you guys right back. Okay, here we are with our top tier cannon box, as you guys can obviously see. I don't think anybody from Relentless is checking because they just straight up don't care about our post at this point. They're F top one by a long shot. I don't even have a barrel or anything on this. It's like dry. The whole back is open. Let's actually go ahead and TNT fill, put like 300 shots, 50 bank. We should be full. We got the sandbox down and we should have our adjust set up and we do and we should be good to lever. Our post is like super simple to breach. You don't even have to adjust or anything. Let's go ahead and button. Oh, Yoda somehow found us. But we should be good. Surely, surely. Yeah, okay, we're good. <laughs> okay, yeah, Relentless is actually here, but they don't care that we're raiding it because they obviously don't need... Oh my God, there's no shot haste patches. I hate you. <laughs> All we need to do is shoot TNT inside the art post one time and they can have it back, bro. I just need to sell and buy spawners. Haze, Ocelot, I'm gonna bro. <laughs> <laughs> so today, guys, we're trying to take our <laughs> All right, buddy. Okay, I joined Call of Cope, and they're a bunch of trolls, but they're letting us have it. We're like one wall off. We're double tapping through that mine chat. Somehow, I don't know how we're clipping. It's literally one mine chat. Okay, we went through it. All right, there we go. <laughs> oh my god. Now we have to wait for the world to actually reset, and then we will end up capturing it and getting the buffs. Okay, we've got our boost. We've got our candy corn. Let's go ahead and see if we can get a decent boost. I'm hoping for above 190%. I would actually be so upset if we don't. 184. That's not horrible. Like, I need to go all out. We have so much money waiting to be oh, 197%. That is perfect. 103 million, 101 million, 96, 820 million, almost a billion from one collection chest. 370, 240. Oh my God, boys. So much money in the bank. And there we go. $3.8 billion, essentially. And we should still have all of our gunpowder and stuff like that that shouldn't have sold. Yeah, we do. 10.4 million gunpowder, like 1 million gunpowder, a ton in here as well. So we have unlimited TNT at this point. So we check F top, 1.2 billion, essentially. 2.8K evokers, 4.6 IGs, 3.3K creepers, 1,400 skeletons, 15,000 zombies. And where do we even have chickens, bro? I mined all of them. Okay, but anyways, it is time to go ahead and withdraw all of our money from the f bank as well 2.3 billion so two that that's so many zeros i just don't know is that 2.3 it sure is we have six billion dollars where does that actually put us we are the fourth richest person on the entire server and guess where that is all going evoker spawners it's actually going into our fifth value box as well we should have plenty of room i don't even know how many inventories of evokers six billion dollars is we're about to find out though that's for sure slash shop let's see evoker spawners fill inventory so entire inventory for five point oh my god for five point what i'm gonna have to move on to another box i think this is gonna overfill this box as well that is actually insane we just bought so many evokers i'm gonna fill this up boys i'm gonna go ahead and spend the remaining one billion on evokers as well try to find somewhere to place all these spawners and then i'll bring you guys back with an update i'm assuming we're gonna be at like 1.5 billion somewhere around there we should be closing in on swisher actually like i mentioned spawners do take so long to go and actually age so much value i legit had to start putting spawners on the inside of like the spawner rings and now half of these are covered by blocks so they won't even spawn i have no choice i don't want to extend these boxes any lower because i want to make them super Super hard to actually hit. I guess I could put them in here. Oh my god, I forgot. I still have a billion of oh my I legit <laughs> We're gonna have so much value up, bro. I'm gonna go ahead and spend the rest of this money on evokers. There we go. Another multiple stacks. And then I'm gonna end the clip here. I'm gonna wake up in the morning, probably like seven in the morning for me. Hopefully, the EUs and AUs take over overnight in the late NAs until I can wake up at like seven in the morning, check walls again. But yeah, this is definitely not updated as of recently, where I'm probably around 1.4, 1.5 billion. Okay, good news. It is now the next day. It's like four o'clock, I believe. And if we check F top we're still up there 1.64 billion dollars of value we're actually closing in on the gap on swisher they have 2.1 billion and i don't know if you guys i don't know what you guys saw i don't know if this is after or before but there's a massive team fight with both swisher and south korea on our walls like 10 minutes ago and i'm pretty sure our boys are still like messing around with them like switching them into traps or something yeah attempting to but i'm checking buffers really quickly but then i also do want to go ahead and see how much money we actually made overnight and go ahead and sell just to see if we're actually making decent money having like thousands of spawners placed and then obviously placing that value back into our box trying to catch swisher let me go ahead and finish up with our buffer checks really quickly and we should be pretty good i doubt anybody's over 1500 blocks away no cannon's gonna one by one that far there's no way i just crashed all right okay we're back online let's go ahead and actually grab out our candy corn our infinite cell wand as well now how much do we actually have in here like 11 mil 12 let's see over here 150 million 34 million 12 55 okay i don't exactly know how much we're gonna make oh 135 and another 
33 as well. Thank you very much. I'll definitely take that. Let's go ahead and get a little booster if we can. Come on. Be like 180 plus percent. 194. That will definitely work. Okay, there we go. Let's go ahead and sell. We're going to be up probably close to a billion dollars once again. So we're going to buy all of that into evokers in 1.21 billion. Okay, how many evoker can we actually go ahead and buy? Let's see. And like eight stacks beautiful we're starting to fill up we don't really have room for spawners i'm gonna have to go on like the inside i think and start placing spawners on the inside of the boxes then i wonder if half of these will even spawn oh well it doesn't even matter at this point we just need to get as much value down as possible in the last week or so uh, okay i should be able to shoot now as long as they don't they're gonna try to glitch in my scaffolding i think boys hang on i see i see okay everything's right i'm gonna button can anyone confirm yeah, we got time up. Okay. Uh, I need uh, for forcers. We need people hitting them to make sure that they can't chunk bust. Because the best way to counter the against these cannons is by chunk busting the sand and all that. Yo, they claim to behind you, heroic. He's literally passing for free. We we only have one person forcing. Come on, boys. They're I trying to set up a box the behind. They're trying to set up a box behind. They have three people in a box behind. They're block busting. Uh, they're they're free patch. They, we're about to get in, boys. If we can just get someone. They're only yeah, inside. They're already building the counter. Like, we need to breach within a couple minutes. As soon as we get into this box, we're blowing it to crap, and then we're rebuilding our buffers. So we, we need, like, five, six people rebuilding building buffers. Like, we have nine in call, but I feel like we have, like, no one, like... Yeah, they're, I feel like... I like we have four people. Like, we need to we're get in with, like, within, like, hitting. four minutes, probably. Are we hitting fresh at all? No, okay. we're not. We yeah, are. yeah, we are. Are we? Yeah. Okay, we are now. It's like, two more. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. We're on obby, we're on obby, we're on obby. Holy, holy. Come on, boys. We're still good. They're slowly building. I got three people building. We're good. I set up a 45, bro. Yeah, we're about in. We're about in. We're about in. One shot. We're in. Get in, get in, get in, get in, get in, get in. Blow it up, blow it up, blow it up. Oh my god, good work, boys. Yeah, put lo lava buckets and dispensers, like in boosters. Don't blow up all the dispensers. Put lava buckets and boosters. Shadow Master, the dispensers right under you, put lava buckets in each one of them. All the boosters put lava buckets in. Because they're still building this cannon. I guarantee they're gonna try to rebuild theirs and go again. They're still rebuilding the back counter. 